From donations to prayers, an East Tennessee church in 10 Mile is asking for help all to build a new home for a Vietnam veteran. His home now practically unlivable and in need of desperate repair. 10 News reporter Marissa Rio shares how church members want to turn the Vietnam veteran's life back around, starting with that house. Bill Hughes attends Luminary United Methodist Church. It's the same church his friend, 75-year-old Vietnam veteran Virgil, attends every Sunday. He sits in that corner in church every once in a while, amen, you know, that's Virgil. The church community loves Virgil and wants him to love where he lives. And we would pass that house and go, that can't be good. That just can't be good. Virgil has been living in this home. Squalor. A home deemed unsafe. The roof is caving in. Um, you walk in the door and the kitchen, if you want to call it that, is on a dirt floor. Virgil's only source of income comes from his social security check, making him unable to afford much. He has not had running water for seven years, okay? He comes to the church to take his showers a couple times a week. The church started a GoFundMe with a goal to raise $60,000. The money will go toward building a new home for the Vietnam vet. Virgil's a Marine Corps veteran. And he gave all of this up for his country, okay? And uh, he deserves more than this. Hugh says Virgil barely spends any time in his small, decaying shack. He's hoping sooner than later, Virgil can have a place to actually call home. No one should have to live like that. No one. Especially a human being that God created, and he's a Marine Corps veteran in the United States of America. No. Reporting in 10 Mile, I'm Marissa Rios. They hope to start construction on Virgil's new home by the end of this year.